find some intruders about to die. See, we have somebody over there that's gonna be data drained. Uh, I believe Moonstone just died. I'm actually going to do this. Data draining. Hello and welcome back to more Dahak Outbreak. We're going to continue on with our word list, doing a lot of these different areas that came recommended to us by our party members. They kind of want to go off and do other things, and it feels like in this beginning portion of the game, we're getting a feel because we're losing party members. They're going off because they've got personal issues. Uh, we have some party members who just feel certain ways and feel like they need to play the game and do something to kind of get over it. Or you, you find out that they just have personal lives and they can't always be there. And I like that. I like that in this game. Because this is a person playing a MMO RPG. And so they balance the characters well between being available 24 seven versus realizing, oh, these are actual people that they're playing who have these other lives besides just playing video games and are always available. Meanwhile, our character's a high school student whose friend is in a coma and is trying to figure out a much bigger secret from this game and it seems like the corporation of the game is just kind of like covering up murders at this point. And uh, he, he's in it pretty deep. And all he wants to do is play the game with his friend. That's it. And here we go. High school student. Now, uh, now maybe a victim of some corporation. So we'll see how this game turns out. <laughs> Anyways, without further ado, let's get in the game. And that really is how this game's coming now. Wordless. <laughs> We gotta go to Soaring Sky Madness Compass area invited to by Sanjiro. Master Sword Quiz Dungeon is located there. So that is what we are gonna go do. We need to get ourselves Sanjiro and one other party member. So let's get Sanjiro level 55. Oh, it's you. Wait just a minute. And let's see who else should we bring with us. Who else can we bring with us? He's at a 55 with a zero. Got anybody? Oh, 54. We got Moonstone. Eros is at 54 too, but Moonstone's beating them. Still with Moonstone. 509. Oh, we have Moonstone still winning. Maybe we can get lower than 54 and 509. All right, so it's Moonstone. I'm coming. <laughs> Ew. Um, all right, there we go. We got our team. I'm pretty sure their equipment needs to be updated. I don't think Sandro, so I think I took Sandro with me. Yeah, I did. He's got some pretty good equipment. Could use a better chess piece. Maybe some better hand and leg gear. Seeing as we're now coming across like level 60 stuff. Uh, Moonstone, on the other hand, I believe this is the first time that we have used him since playing uh, Outbreak. Yeah, and all his stuff's level 52. So I'm gonna have to go and get some stuff for Moonstone, which I have so many different twin blades for him, and the ones that I'm carrying would benefit him. So, I'll be right back. And we're back. Managed to get everyone pretty well equipped, and I think that they are going to be ready to take on this next level. It's not too high off of their levels. I think it's a level 55 area. 56, okay. So two levels higher than what they normally are. It's a darkness area, so that's super cool. 
we hardly ever go to darkness areas. I have lightning attacks. This is gonna be great. I'm gonna breeze through. I'm gonna just attack and destroy so many darkness types. But there's also a mixture of other types of creatures here, so we'll see what happens. Let's go. We're definitely gonna be getting some experience. Gonna be leveling up, gonna be getting stronger. It's raining here too. So that means when we go to that well over there, we are not gonna throw in our blades. We're just gonna tell them that we're missing a golden axe and get a golden axe. Or what's the silver axe? So there is a portal just right behind us. Oh, what? Before we go, strengthen. Octor. There we go. Before I forget. Make our guys stronger. Always be strengthened. Octor. So that's all that Sandra has. Meanwhile, I'm over here just gonna be casting up a storm. Curious to see what we are gonna be fighting against in this area. through this one. Oof, look at that infection. I'm gonna have to probably chill on that for a bit. And 
an app core. Sandro hit him with uh, the thing that he has. And then let's go ahead and all rep the Moonstone. And all rep Moonstone again. Sandro is going to be back to full by the time we get to another portal. But hey, there you have it. One portal down, many to go, and I'll see you at the last portal. And, and at the spring. Get to the spring. Go to the spring. Grow a lot of gales. The spring has a rod of gales. Because it's raining, it's gonna make it weaker if I say neither. Did you lose a golden axe? Or was it a silver axe? Honestly, I forget which one I have more of. God, I want to say it was golden axes. I'm just going to say a silver axe this time. A silver axe, you say? Yeah. Till next time. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, there we go. Trading a duplicate weapon for a silver axe when it's raining. All right, time for that last portal. Gotta hit these guys with attack skills. Gotta hit pretty hard as we see Moonstone's getting. Quite a beating on him. Take one down. The other one can be a bit manageable. Bother data draining it. Just take them out. Just give me that experience. Just level my people. They need it. And there you have it. The field is cleared. The dungeon is right over here. It's one of those mouthy dungeons. So let's go inside. Do a sword quiz. Welcome to the Master Sword Quiz Dungeon. There are rooms in this dungeon with questions. Oh. The answers are related to the exit. If you are correct, you will go on. But if you are wrong, you will return to the first room. Uh. Well, good luck on getting the Tonosama sword at the bottom. So there's a question here. Let's see a question. Let's see a chest. It's Dragon Crest. A level 56 headpiece for Wave Master. Complete the following sentence. A blank earned is a blank saved. Penny earned is a penny saved. North, money. 
West, Lover. East, Penny. Could be Lover. Oh. Complete the following sentence. Patience is a blank. It is a virtue. North, virtue. West, <laughs> crime. East, tragedy. Ah, uh, yes, the crime of patience. Disappearing at two in time. Complete the following sentence. All right. A blank in need is a blank indeed. A friend in need is North, a friend indeed. Man. I West. Japanese friend. Is better. East. Lawyer. Go east. Complete the following sentence. Two heads are better than blank. North, nothing. Better than nothing. West, one. East, you. Two heads are better than you. I tell people that all the time. West again. Complete the following sentence. One man's junk is another man's blank. Another man's taco. North, treasure. West, junk. East, keep. Man's junk is another man's junk. Seems like a good solid saying, but I think we'll go north. And stairs. Parasol. Looks like we gotta fight a thing. The big thing is treasure chest. Alright. Chaos Wing. A little anticlimactic, but alright, I'll take it. Chaos spell, chaos spell. And we'll 
Don't guess chaos spell? A hangman. Here we go, this is where the rear sword is. Open it up. What do we get? We now have Tonosama sword to the key items. Now have silver scarab. You now have artisan soul. So this is it. Give it to me. Let's give it to Don't him. Don't worry, I know. So demanding. Thanks for helping me again. Here, take this in return. Secret reason. Our friends are just giving us secret stuff. There we go. That was the challenge. The field was tough. These monsters in this area are getting pretty tough. They usually will either have like magical tolerance or physical tolerance. And that kind of determines what happens. I'm just glad my character is kind of versatile in both. And using those tarot card items is really coming in handy. So putting the moon or the hanged man on a monster while I take care of another one. Like in that field we had physical tolerance and magical tolerance come out at once. So while we would be focusing on one, the other one would just be beating us up on top of getting hit by the one we're fight facing. So being able to like freeze one of them while we take care of one and then going after them was a, a lot more simpler to deal with. Let's go see what this item is. It's a book that gives us magical defense plus two. Yeah. Now our magical defense is 47. So good. So good. And Sandro gets a wonderful rare sword out of it. But it was just a key items thing, so I'm not even sure if he is gonna have that item equipped when we see him next. If maybe it's just a decoration type thing. But hey, that's none of my business. Anyways. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next game of Dot Hack Outbreak. Goodbye.